Hi, Sarah here from Valley City Barnes County Public Library with today's craft, which is a paper bag book. And we're doing this because today is library shelfie day. So what you'll need are four brown paper bag lunch sacks, some ribbon or string, double-sided tape, a hole puncher, scissors, and just some plain paper. I'm just using a little bit more of a color instead of plain white. So to start, what we do is we'll take all four of our paper bags, make sure they're facing the same way. And so I have it so the flap here on the back will be you know, on the back and then, so it kind of helps facing it away. And you'll fold all four in half together, just like this. And then you'll take your hole punch. And if you have to, you can do one at a time if it's easier for the hole punch. So then you'll just take and you'll make three punches. So one about there. One in the middle. And one up top again. And if it doesn't go all the way through, that's okay. Like mine, I just have to kind of pick them out a little. So I'll finish doing that. So again, before I do this last one, I have it so the bottom flap is folded in towards the half, and then I'm just three hole punching the spine. And now, once you get that all done, I'm gonna use three different colors. I'm just gonna kind of guesstimate here. So then you're gonna thread you know, through the top, the middle, and the bottom. You're gonna thread them together. For me, it helps to twist it just to make it smaller. I won't tie it until I get the rest of the colors in. So I have all of my colors strung through. So now I'll tie it. Just like you're tying a shoe.
Okay, so now what you'll do, once you're done with your string, is you'll take some paper, and I already cut some into just smaller pieces so that they fit on the cover and the pages. And with that, so since I have these, I'll just kind of cut around them. I'm going to leave my cover blank for now. But so open up to what will be your first page. You'll take one sheet of paper and some double sided tape. You can use one piece or two. I'm going to use two so that I know it sticks. So you'll place one or two pieces on one side of the paper, just like this. And then you'll just flip it over and just push it down and then tape it to the inside, just like that. And you'll just do that if, if you want. You can do it on the inside. Just remember, you'll have the flap here, so it won't be a flat surface to write or color on. papers. Like I said, I chose to leave the front and the back plain, but you can easily put the paper. But now you have a book that you can draw or write a story in. All right. So if you would like a kit, please call us at 845-3821. Again, I will have ribbon and paper bags and the sheets to put on inside. You will just need to get a hole punch and double-sided tape. And if you want plain white paper or a different color paper, we have some. So just let us know when you call. And please follow us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. Thank you.